Melissa. This is like tea for calming down. I know. I know what it is. And so tell me about what's happening today. Well, today is a very important day for us. It's the day guys. New students are coming in and hopefully we're gonna get them drunk. I forgot, I forgot everything today, okay? And I forgot my belt. Uh, because we need a belt for one game, okay? And I had to give up one, you know? So I'm running around in loose pants right now. Not fun. Yesterday or uh, Yeah, but how are we gonna get them to them? We will maybe I can go back and the canteen and find four men. We have four teams, right? I have here four teams, yes. Yeah, so we'll okay. find four cups. We are doing uh, a nice day for the new students. So they will have a, a nice welcome. We'll make some mini games and they have to uh, to win them all. And then there will be uh, 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 some gifts and after that we will go downstairs and uh, Doing a couple of view with them. I am a going to tutor, first semester student. Just like I had a tutor when I started here, I'm going to like, give them a proper introduction to the real things about the school. Yeah, I want to see what kind of team I've drafted this year, and uh, of course, the international have was for most years been uh, superior. But this time around, I think that's going to change. I think the Danish actually could maybe come with a little bit of surprise this year, I don't know. Uh, Ali, is that not okay. So far, um, I think it's going good. They're still a bit shy, but we hope we're gonna figure it out. Um, um, I have a hard time finding words to describe how disastrous this is. Um, there has been like some. Uh, not miscommunication, miscommunication, I've just lost that little bit of information. Going really as planned, <laughs> so it would be, it, it could not be better, actually. Well, the good thing is I know their names now. <laughs> this is the only thing that gets me through this day. I'm dying inside. Yeah, yeah, I think uh, they should maybe come, come earlier to prepare all the things, but I think in between all of the stuff, it was really organized. One, two, three, start! <laughs> come on, come on! Thank you. We just gave them a break. Okay. Uh, then when they finish, I'm gonna call you so you can wait. <laughs> the girls think they have an advantage. Sure, they have done most of the planning and they have the international, so by default, they would automatically think they have the, like they will win this this thing. But what they don't know is a lot. We have come to the agreement that a lot uh, of the victory of the whole day, like the war itself, relies on solely the beer pong tournament later. So what I did is I ditched one of our activities and made up some points for whatever team and agreed with everybody like Shh, if the other two just ask we did the watermelon thing right and they was like yeah yeah sure so what we did is we made everybody shoot some shots uh, at the beer pong and to like see who would be our chosen ones if it comes down to like the final game so we already had determined a captain and such i mean the result is all that matters right right So, uh, what's your opinion on uh, cheaters in competitions? Um, cheaters, they're bad. We don't like them. And, How uh, can they cheat in beer pong? Would you say that... Um, uh,
do you still believe that the international class can win despite uh, recent allegations of cheating? What cheating? What's cheating? <laughs> Who's cheating? Please. Cameraman, please answer me. I could never, ever, in my wildest, wildest dreams, I would do something like that. Jacob, move me. It sounds something that the internationals would do, not the Danish. So no, I think you should go uh, take your questions to. Go in here. Thing? Yes. Is it true that you have been accused of drunk driving in the past? Yes. I heard there was some cheating involved in your past. I could never. I would never cheat on Laura. Never. I am faithful to the one and only woman I love. What about the competition? I would never cheat in the competition. Why are you laughing? Because I thought about how much I love my girlfriend. No bullshit. Uh, I need to, like, if you have some allegations, I need to, like, hear the allegations before I can comment on them. I just heard some gossip about the cheating with beer pong competition. A cheating with beer pong competition? I'm never sorry. have I ever heard anything more ridiculous than that. Well, I heard that my mom loved me, and I think that's more ridiculous. As a representative of the academy, do you endorse the cheating, lying and dishonesty that's been going on? Always. Like, it's, it's part of our nature. It's in the core. Get out! Thank you, boy. <laughs> I don't some cheating at home. No. I, I told them uh, my anger is really bad. So... Yes. Do you speak Yeah, yeah. I don't speak Danish. I can't speak Danish. I can't go. We don't speak they're just a perfect uh, class, so. Mm hmm You're nervous. I'm not. You're sweating. I'm not. I'm always you're sweating, lying. I always smell, and I'm you, always quiet. You're, you're, you're I'm lying always to me. Never, How no. can you lie to me? We were born in the same city. I don't, yes. I'm sorry, but I don't lie. How do you think you would cheat in beer pong? In beer pong, I think they could just uh, simulate our, you know, throwing the, the ball um, and maybe trying to try to, to, to cheat, you know, putting the ball into, into the glasses, the, the cartoon the glasses. That's not what's happening. I think I know what they did. I think they practiced ping pong. Uh, yeah, I just gotta apologize in advance for the absolute dark quality of this uh, documentary. It's not my first time. It is my second time. And you know, third time's the charm, and we're not quite there yet, so... Um, but maybe next year. No, next year I'll be gone. I'm never gonna make this in this industry, am I? Um, no, I wanted to uh, wait. So you got here, and then everybody can... <laughs> I don't like this. <laughs> <laughs> it's a, uh, it's a, uh, cross, cross Jake. Jake. <laughs> 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 well, his take on my knees is true though. I know you can't say anything to Jacob. So I'm going to be a secret. And when we finish with the last challenge, they can uh, maybe practice on the beer farm themselves, you know, to to get the good measurements, I guess. You know. Are you a big fan of good measurements? The second best group that won. Did you count the points? Nope, not yet. But so you have to count the points? We don't have three games. No, the first best group and fight over the third or the fourth place. Oh, so it's like... Yeah, so second group fights for the third and the fourth. Yeah, and the first best group? 
from the Danish and the international class fight over the first and the second place. Yeah. Okay, we're just uh, about to finish uh, making the teams out oh, to be sure okay. that we have the advantage. I mean, uh, we have a fair competition. Do you need some help with the math? Um, I, I yeah. <laughs> really? <laughs> So we both know one thing is what can our soldiers do on the battlefield, right? Of course, Poland would have the better army compared to Denmark. You have more troops, yeah. that is more highly trained combatants. But, but what can the generals do in a peer pressure situation? When our allies are on the tutors, can they handle that kind of pressure? My men wants to see their tutors against your tutors. I don't drink beer, stupid. Well, you, you can get some. You can get a trash can to just. I wanna play. So we have an exhibition match. At the end of it all, to really determine who is the superior. <laughs> all right. No elbow across this line. I will be judging, and I won't accept elbows. All right. Unless it's this one. <laughs> um. It's a two shots, two person from each team. And uh, they can't shoot at the same time. We're not having rules if both balls hit the same. It's unfortunate only count as one here. We're not going to have a lot of extra rules. We just want to see pure skill and not tactics. That's bullshit. All right. Is there anything I mm, I missed? Ten shots. But the double bounce. Yeah, ten shots each. Yeah. Each person has ten shots. And uh, yeah, uh, trick shots count for two. That's the only uh, like rule you have. And bounces off the table can be <laughs> struck. <laughs> it's the Danish pride we have here, all right? <laughs> hey! My boys came in. I can't believe it all started Monday. I get already so big. We just won the first game. People will call this a competition, but I saw it as nothing but a mere slaughterhouse. You know what? To be expected, they played all the time. And in the Danish corner, <laughs> with 238 pounds, Pussy! Sebastian! Coach. I forgot her name again. <laughs> Anya. Anya. <laughs> All right, you know, this is the final game. All the points that have been accumulated today means nothing. Means absolutely nothing. What means right now is 10 shots each, 6 cups, 2 balls, 1 winner. I'm good at math. <laughs> like, the match is not over yet, but uh, I have definitely a good feeling that this is gonna become a Danish, Danish victory today. Chipko can suck my dick. <laughs> So, uh, what are your thoughts on the match? I think it was rigged. They definitely cheated. And uh, I think Jacob always forgets that I'm the only reason why he has a girlfriend. And I think it's pretty unfair that he doesn't treat me like that. So, uh, can you describe to me what just happened? Yeah, um, what just happened is uh, you saw me meditating before, uh, probably my personal greatest game. Um, I, I don't think I've ever had so much pressure on me. If I was a piece of coal, I would probably become a diamond already. Well, to uh, summarize why we ended up here, um, 
Well, my my boys in the class, uh, they pulled through. Even got a, a two cup point at one at one point in the game, and I'm I'm really proud because uh, I handpicked those two to become the team that would win it all. Because I knew this this game in particular would. It was just not. It's the Danish pride, you know. Beer pong is something that we start playing when we are four years old. So of course I need to have this win. I think the main takeaway here is um, I don't know if there's really a main takeaway from this. I think it's anti cheating, don't cheat in games or in life. Hmm. No, it's not really it. Friendship. Friendship, that's the main takeaway here. Although, I don't think anyone's going to be good friends after this. Wrist, wrist is important. Okay. That's impressive, you know? But just, you, you have to train. You have to. Nice! 